You see black youngster's brother? Nigga. All right, nigga. Nigga, I don't know who had to be, who's involved in that, but I, nigga, I don't know, but I'm just a... Okay, chat. Last topic I'm, I'm, I'm reacting to because I gotta run to this, this motherfucking thing. I'm coming back tonight. I don't care. Yo, Asia, you, you around tonight, fool? I'm be around tonight. I might go to TwitchCon in my picture. Okay. Just don't get banned like, hey, oh, we gotta talk about TwitchCon too. Chat. I don't care if I'm, yo, I might do a drunk stream tonight. So if I'm super drunk, just like forgive me. Like, just like, let me rock. Cause I, I gotta get my shit off. And like, this is, I, I can't stream for three hours. I talk too much. I gotta stream for like seven hours today. So. I'm going to go do this shit, and I'm going to come back. I might be drunk, but we're going get it, to get it in, all right? They said Blueface proposed to Jaden Alexis, which, by the way, I think he's only doing this to get Krishan Rock mad, but let me hear this. I ain't gonna lie to you. <laughs> this is such like a joke to me. I could never even see Blueface really proposing. This nigga really got on one knee. And which, by the way, I think this is all like get back at Krishan Rock. Krishan Rock, which is baby mama. Which, by the way, I think he wants to be with her. Uh, and this is my synopsis of the whole situation. Blueface, you, you know, we ain't got no more beef, bro. Like, we squash it. Or we squash it my head. If you mad, that's on you, nigga. <laughs> um... Bro, you made Krishan rock. She's super lit. She's like one of the most popular females out right now. She's even more popular than Ari. She, does, she I mean, she calls herself rapping, but she really don't rap. Okay? She's just a social media personality that has a lot of people that like her. You created that. You did love her and like her at a point. And my synopsis is that when you had her under your control, before she realized her own fame and notoriety and what she could do, you liked it. The moment she started listening to other people because now she has a brand that you built and she realized, wait, why am I, why are all my paychecks going to him? I could collect my own shit. I don't need him to book shows for me. Everybody's going to hit me for shows anyway. She cut you off. Again, I think because, you know, even when I saw you on, on Sharpie show the first time with that Sharp Tank shit with, you know, that wannabe pimping mentality shit, bro, you want to control her based on the fact that you know she loves you. She tied your name eight times. She clearly loves you. She wants to appease you. She wants to be with you. She got all them tattoos, and you know it mentally. She ain't covered not one of them. So you know at least no matter who she fucks, she probably wants to get back with you, but you need to give her something to make her feel like you're lose she's losing you, right? So she had a baby with you, which usually for women is security. What do you do? You say it's not your baby, right? Oh, you fuck 10 niggas, ain't my baby. Because you, you need to keep that atmosphere of, yo, shit, don't act like you still got me, right? Now, you know, she's using your tactics on you in terms of she did a, a song with Lil Mabu and she the tattoo she has over her vagina that usually says Jonathan's pussy, you know, obviously she didn't really tattoo Lil Mabu's pussy, but it was like, you know, they probably did some editing work and put his name there. She's also like, you know what I mean, texting him all the time. They're doing a bunch of social media shit to make it seem like she's fucking with him or he took her from you and it's making their song go up. You're enraged by this. You don't like this. You get what I mean? Like, number one, I think you know at the, at the beginning of the day, I don't know if that baby real, but if that baby real, you know that's your baby, brother. So now you're trying to get her mad and you're trying to do it in a way where you don't have the cars no more. I know you don't got the cars no more, and I'm not trying to diss you, Blueface. Trust me, like, bro, I get you. Like, bro, I really think me and you, we could get along. I don't even think it ain't like that with me no more. I know you're trying to do this because you're doing shit out of character. Blueface, you the nigga who usually spit pimp lurch. Nigga, you had a song called, yo, I tell my bitch I'm on my way when I'm not even on my way. I tell my bitch don't ask me no questions. That's how you talking. You're trying to talk like the pimp. Bro, you're on your knees proposing to your baby moms. You feel what I'm saying? Like, again, you're not doing this because you want to do this and you're trying to make an honest woman out of her. You're trying to do this because you're trying to get Krishan Rock upset. You're trying to do this because you're not the A-side no more. But you do know she still loves you. She has seven tattoos of you. If she really didn't love you, she would have covered them bitches up. So you need to do something to make her feel something. 
So you signed your baby mama. She don't care. You did a song with you did a song called Baby Mama Drama, and also you launched some shit called MILF Music. You promoted her. You know what she did? Baby Daddy Drama with another nigga, and she claiming that she fucking him. Shit hurts you. I get it. So what you do now? You trying to hurt her back. You're like, all right, cool. I'm gonna let her know that what what every woman wants is to be a honest woman. All that baby mama culture, that shit for the birds. Don't listen to the young Miami and them chicks. All them chicks want to be married to the father of their child. Don't listen to none of these girls who act like, bro, your pussy ain't DoorDash. You ain't just here to drop off a baby like a stork. You want to be having a family. So you know what Blueface is doing? This is his leverage. All right, I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to give... I'm going I'm, I'm, I'm to turn my baby mama, my first baby mama, into an honest woman. I'm going to give her what you want from me. And let's see how you feel about it. Now, this is here my prediction. I don't think that his baby mama going to react how he thinks she's going to react. She does love him, but she peeped the game already. She peeped the game that ultimately the leverage that he wants to have over her is the money and the fame, and she has it both. She he knows that she don't love like that that no with all due respect to you, Jaden. I don't got no problem with you. I'm not trying to disrespect you either. That nigga don't look at you as a wife. He don't love you like that. He's doing that to piss off his other baby moms. He's doing that to piss off of of um uh um Krishan. So she peep game. So you trying to do it, she peeping game and she like, all right, cool. I'll keep cloud chasing with you too. Except I'm more, I'm the littest party in this. I'm going to get the most money. Again, this is a nice ploy. I don't think Krishan Rock comes back around. But who knows? Maybe she does. Because, you know, sometimes these women are emotional. You know, again, she, ha she has a newborn by Blueface that Blueface ain't visiting at this point. Blueface is saying, you're a bad mom and I'm going to take her from you. And when I take her from you, I'm going to have my other baby mom raised. And now all of a sudden he's in love with his baby mom, making her an artist and now getting on one knee to marry her. It is what it is, right? Uh, Blueface, <clears throat> one thing I'm going to give you, I'm, I'm going to give you, I'm going to give you credit for being an entertainer because you are one of the few that have opened up your life and been so honest that you don't give a fuck what people say about you. It is going to be entertainment, whether in your favor or not. And I think that will lead you to get money. I do think there's some psychological effects that's going to be felt by the baby and other people involved with this. But right now, there's some good old entertainment. Hey, um, anybody else with added comments about this or no? Man, if I was Blueface, I'd be pissed off. Why would you be pissed off? For the off? simple fact, nigga, he could have left her on the street, curb. Nigga, trash. That's she was what you went on the show. Nigga, he made her lit, rich, and now she's trolling him with a with another nigga. Bro, I'll be highly upset at you. Would be mad? You sign a bitch, like not buzz. You put a bitch on, give her all the shit she like, cause she's a nobody for him. Yeah. Make her lit. Make give her money. She was a bum. Made that ten dollars in her account. Mm -hmm. And now she's like flexing on you. Like, nigga, you want to feel some type of what? I agree. No, I agree. Like that's the worst part about it. Why you got signed these girls, bro? Yeah, he but, yeah but here's the thing. He now he's saying he's getting married to his baby mama. Do you think he really wants to get married to his baby mama? Um, I think he been was gonna like he been fucking her for a while, so I think he was gonna do that. Nah, Anyways, nah I don't, like, no, 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 no. Yo, Blueface, Blueface is one of them niggas, bro. He's clearly stated, yo, he thinks she's an amazing mother. He don't think she's an amazing wife. Because he talks about in front of her and he openly brags that he loves fucking other women and he talks about other relationships that he has. He looks at her and, and I'm yes, trying to give her credit. She's a good mother. He, he is looking for more than what she is in terms of a partner. If he wasn't, he would have never got to that point with Kershaw Rock. Trust me. I agree. I agree with that, but now he probably realized, like, bro, because his big mom, this one, could have done exactly what Krishan Rock just did. You know what I'm saying? Like, she could have cloud chased. She could have probably went to go fuck another rabbit, even though she's kind of ugly. But she probably could have went to go. She could have been fucking niggas. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Why he's been doing all this goofy shit he's been doing. She could have been out. You know, every other. Almost every other. No, no. You see Jada Wader, nigga? No, no. She didn't fucking. She no, no. make a don't ass. She, 
What's hey, the point, she Brittany? Away. I don't. She I don't think. Away. I don't think Jaden can do what Krishan Rock does. Or no, 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 no. He's not talking about Krishan Rock. Bro. He's talking about Jaden Alexis. So his, his baby mama. What what AJ is saying is yes. that the regular women these days, based on what they see online, if they know their nigga is out there fucking other women, what they normally do is go out and go get treached out. And it usually fucks yes. up any potential of a nigga fucking with them. One thing I could say about this Jaden Alexis girl is that I've never seen her get treached out by another rapper. You get what I mean? Like, yo, yes. the moment that 6 mm. 9 <laughs> baby mama was on stage with little TJ, bro, that nigga was never going to talk to her again in life. Like, you could, bro, it's like he's going to wear that in his grave, in his casket, my nigga. Like, he's not fuck. Yo, the moment that Rick Ross, his baby mama, took her, his two kids and brought to Floyd Mayweather's house in the middle of a beef with uh, um, with, with uh, 50 Cent, and 50 Cent was rubbing his hand in Rick Ross's kids' hair, bro, the moment that happened, and you could act like, if you go to her page now, she'll say that Ross don't fuck with her till now. Bro, Ross ain't even on that no more, but he hates that chick for life. So it's certain shit you do. One thing I can say about this Jaden Alexis chick, we ain't never see her. And, and maybe that's a product of because people don't think she looks that good that everybody want her. But who cares? Look good or not? Niggas will try to fuck a chick just because you're his baby mama type shit. And she yeah, must have had Sarah people that tried. Right. She must have had people that tried and clearly she turned it down, which low key... And this is what a lot of women don't realize. Niggas give that the utmost credit. Like, yo, bro, that's that's a real chick. Right. You get what I mean? Which I mean, that 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 alone qualifies her for him getting married to her, if we being honest. Yes, if there was to be right, anything yeah. in that case. Like and yeah. it, bro, she's holding the store down. She was doing the cash register at Blue Face Store one. Blue Face out no fucking Christian Rock on Instagram Love. Like, okay. bro, nigga, yo, no. she is what you call you act. You you once said I forgot exactly the quote you said, but like a girl with low self esteem, bro, nigga, that's her. Like nigga, bro, come on, like act. What girl you know? You or live fucking some other girl, and she's at your restaurant working, cooking, counting money, making sure shit yeah. right. No, no, no. Going AJ, home, tucking the kids yo, in. You're you're a hundred percent right. The only thing I would say to you though, right, with that is that with this woman right i don't think right now he would get married i think eventually like maybe he would right but right now that nigga's still in his prom bitch is still coming his way he's talking about meg sucking him up like bro like right now he don't need to put the ring on her finger now because it's not like she about to leave him she's still holding that like she just gave her a kid like a year and a half ago like bro she, he's good I think he's only putting a ring on her finger. I'm not saying she's not wifey because she hasn't done whore shit. And that's what a lot of women don't realize. If you don't do whore shit, I don't care. You could be like niggas in the world could like play this. AJ, if you look at me and be like, yo, act. Or if anybody be like, yo, act, yo. I don't like, yo, your wife don't look good. Your wife, your wife kind of ugly. Yo, she a little fat. She blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Nigga, I'd rather y'all say all that than y'all could say, Yo, your girl fuck 50 niggas. Nigga. Facts. Like, that's just, Facts. bro, I don't care what you say. Uh, bro, it's just the reality of it. It's like, I will take that over this other shit. That's the reality of it. Yo, and people, yo, females uh, don't realize that shit, though, bro. I'm, a, I'm not going to hold you. I mean, I'm not going to hold you. They don't realize that shit at all, bro. That's true. You'd rather have a girl to just hold it down. But I get your point and what you're saying. Like, she's already proven the fact that She's basically a good bottom bitch for this nigga. He didn't really have to put a ring on it yet to like solidify. It. Yeah, she's he, going he all the part. So I get what you said. But he was already going to do it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. Like, I think that's the reason. I think the timer right now is it's the piss her off type shit. But you know what I mean? Hey, I ain't gonna lie. This is like a saga, which I'm like, yo, man. I don't know if they're filming the reality show still, but like, bro, every day is something, dog. Yeah, bro. Yo, this is gonna go crazy on that new uh season of Crazy in Love, bro. I'm telling you, Zeus already in the back plotting. Mm. Hey, yo, yo, I gotta run. Yo, boom, are you on or not? Nah? Because yo, I'm live. I'm live.